In this video tutorial, I'm going to show you how to get a logo when you create labels and want to do a mail merge in Excel and Word. So in my mail merge folder here, I have my uh, book one spreadsheet that has my names. And I'm going to add the uh, logo here, but I can't paste an image into here. It won't work that way. So I have to do a little something different. I have to get the path of the image and paste it into here. And let me show you how to do that. So I'm going to close this. I'm going to, uh, I have my logo here. It's just a, a Wolfie logo. And I'm going to right click and then go down to properties and click that. And then I'll bring up the properties of the logo, which I'm just going to going to copy this location or path. So I'm going to right click, copy, and then close this out. Now I'm going to go back to my book, my Excel spreadsheet, and I'm going to paste, control V, paste that URL in there. But then I got to add the, the file name. And the file name is logo.logo.png. So I'm going to put another slash and then type in logo.png. And I'm going to copy this down to the next cell. And you can do that, copy it down to all the cells that you have. So now I have first name, last name, and then the path to the logo.png. And let me show you how that works in Word. So I'm going to save this. Save, close, and close this. I don't need that anymore. And then open up Microsoft Word. Go to Mailings, start my Mail Merge. Start my label, Mail Merge. Then I have, a cho have to choose a label that will be big enough to carry the logo and the name. So let me see if I can find one quickly. So this one's pretty good. It's three inches by four inches. Obviously, you would put in the number that um, you have on your box of labels. I'm just picking one randomly. I don't really have labels to put the, this on. So I'm going to click OK. So now I got my labels. I'm going to select my list, which is uh, clicking Use um, Existing List. I'm going to go find my list which is on my desktop in the mail merge folder and it's the book one. Okay and then click OK. So now I'm going to start adding my uh, fields. The first thing I want is the logo and then I want the first name and then last name. And then when I preview this It's just going to have the path and not the logo. So what I need to do here is get off of preview, right click on Seawolf and click edit field. And then I'm going to click on include picture in the field names. Then I have to add that path again up here. And then don't forget to put in the name logo.png and then click OK. So now it's going to add the image. And what I can do is update my labels and then preview my results. And you can see I have my logo and then the text from each line of the spreadsheet. And then finish the merge and then print the document.